friends in this video we are going to see one example on arithmetic progression as the question is very clear here find the sum of odd integers from 1 to 2001 see we have to find sum of odd integers in my previous video I have already explained the formulas that we are going to study in this chapter now one is for finding the nth term an is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d and the other is for finding the sum up to n terms. So here the question is based on sum of odd integers. So here basically uh, we have to write the formula of uh, sum of n terms. So before we write that formula let us first write down the sequence of uh, the question. What sequence we are getting? Odd integers from 1 to 2001. So let's write the odd integers 1, next odd integer is 3, 5, 7 and likewise there are many such odd integers that comes between 1 and 2001. Now here <coughs> as we know in arithmetic progression we have a term called first term which is denoted by A. So here first term in the sequence is 1 next important term is d which is common difference common difference is nothing but the difference between any term from its uh, successive term uh, that is uh, 3 minus 1 it is 2 5 minus 3 is 2 7 minus 5 is 2 that means whichever term we take and the previous term when it is subtracted from it we get a constant number therefore it is an arithmetic progression so here d is 2 and the question states that find the sum of odd integers we have to find the sum so let's write down the formula of sum uh, the formula is formula is sn is equal to n upon 2 into 2a plus n minus 1 into d this is the formula for finding sum up to n terms but do we know which term is this 2001 because sum up to n terms is calculated by this formula but we are not aware here that how many terms are there in this that means we are not aware of the value n we know what is a we know what is d but there is another term n which is to be calculated first so let us find out that term so here we will be using that first formula a n is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d so from the sequence first term is 1 n we are supposed to calculate and the common difference is 2 and here a n stands for the nth term here nth term is the last term we have to find which term is this that will only give us the number of terms right so in the place of a n a n is the value of the last term so here we will replace a n by 2001 now simplification 2001 is equal to 1 plus 2n minus 2 so 2001 here 1 minus 2 is minus 1 and then minus 1 is shifted to left hand side it will be plus 1 and only 2n is left here now this is 2002 and when we bring this 2 to the denominator we are left with value of 1 as 1001 isn't it so our n is this value of n is 1001 now we can substitute it here for calculating sum up to n terms sum up to 1001 terms manually it is very very difficult for us to uh, calculate the sum up uh, sum of 1001 terms isn't it so here uh, that the thing which ease our work is this formula so let's substitute the values here n is 1001 upon 2 then 2 times a is 1 plus again 1001 minus 1 common difference is 2 so here again 1001 upon 2 2 plus 1001 minus 1 is 1000 into 2 so here also we have to here also we have to we can take out 2 common which gets cancelled with this denominator when we take out 2 common 
that gets cancelled with the denominator and we are left with 1001 into 1001 when 1 is added to this so multiplication of these two number is nothing but 1002001 so this is how we calculate sum up to any given term so here we had to find sum of 1001 numbers whatsoever it is uh, in the form of odd integers as per this question so this is how we have to solve and this is the sum of odd integers from 1 to 2001 thank you